Good morning guys. I need to get up and get ready because I'm going to Warwick Castle today and I've had like four hours sleep. Did I get four? No, I've got three. Three, two, one. Showered. Um, done. Now I need to put on my shoes, get ready to go. They'll be here in a minute. Now, out of respect because Asiya's mom um, doesn't want to be around cameras, which is fair enough. A lot of people don't and her little sister as well. So I will do my best to get as much footage as possible whilst respecting that they don't want to be in camera. So a lot of the time I might go off and do a little vlog thing and then get some footage and stuff but i won't have any footage of them obviously i just want to let you guys know so if it seems like there's a few bits where it's like you could have shot that or you could have shot this i'm just being respectful and not only that to other people as well because it is a public place um i don't really want to be running around with my gopro being an idiot so i'm just going to try and respect people as much as possible while still getting you guys epic footage i'm going to try and do both and i feel confident i can anyway let's get my shoes on <laughs> I've been to the shop, eating some food. I think Yim is on her way now um, with her mum and everything. Ahmed might be coming, I'm not too sure. But yeah, the weather is no longer looking nice. It is grey as balls, so it's probably gonna rain. I've got my rain jacket. <laughs> okay, we made it to Warwick Castle. Well, not Warwick Castle, we're at Warwick. And there is an awesome car. Ahmed came in the end. Say hello, Ahmed. Right. <laughs> what are you trying to steal the car for? Did you know I studied castles? You know why they changed the drum towers from square towers? Well, let me tell you, because I know. They used to dig a hole at the bottom of the square towers underneath the corner and light a fire. And it used to heal the rock and make it crumble. And it used to fall down. And that's how they used to break into the castles, you know, when there's wars and stuff. So now that's why they're circular, because they can't heal up a corner for it to crumble. So it doesn't work. There you go. Yeah, it's not that. Castles 101 with kibble. <laughs> I know you all wanted to know that. So there we go. <laughs> History's maze. Let's go. One's to blame for the bloodshed. As a Frenchman said four years before, in another war, you are lions led by donkeys. That's a good quote. It. And look at the kids' way. We're so going on that way. No, not yet. No, get back here. Good, good. Now go that way. I'm in Lord of the Rings with this. Look at this. That is some cool footage. Look at that. 
I see it. You're missing it, look. I know, I can see. But you can't. You can see the back of your head. That's what I can see. What's this line for? Oh, is that the dungeon? Look how big the line is for it. We're going up there. It's literally just a metal bar. And that's a hole. <laughs> Okay, let's set up for a time lap. Okay, so we thought of a new challenge, the look up without squinting challenge. <laughs> oh, it's really bright. Go on. Can I just squint the Just squinting anyway, go on, Asya. <laughs> that face. Though. I'm guessing you'd like run over here and go and shoot people. Whoa. <laughs> It's a bit musty in here, isn't it? So musty. Oh yeah. It's even mustier. What is that smell? Where's that here? Oh there. It's called Sydney, and Sydney is the oldest eagle that we have at the castle, being reared by Ma and Pa in the normal manner, and then something fairly horrendous happened. Essentially, the whole forest that he was in was on fire, and if it wasn't for the brave actions of a Canadian ranger climbing up a tree and saving Sydney and another sibling that we have called Samantha, then we wouldn't have them here today. And uh, Samantha were hungry of birds, they were put in the navy with I guess all the other ones that we weren't expecting to breed from. So we put them in an area with a couple of white tailed sea eagles, uh, another bald eagle that we have called Archie, and then we notice Hank is an Egyptian vulture. Here he is already. And he gets paid to fly around over the tops of people's heads with a couple of inches to spare. But I will warn you in advance a couple of inches to spare is open to artistic interpretation. Okay? <laughs> so what that actually means is if he looks as though he's going to fly in here, he probably is. Okay? jump out of the tree, fly across it, and then he's going to nail it to the floor. As he approaches, whatever it is that he's trying to catch at night time, be it a rat, a mouse, a small bird, or whatever, he actually has to throw his feet out, punch it into the floor, securing it in his needle sharp talons. So that's what we're looking for. Okay, Ernie, are you ready for this? Look at him there. He's leaning forward. Are you ready? Go, 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 go! Feel the energy from the crowd. <laughs> that was a year that don't clap him on a <laughs> Now, 
That was a huge build up there I gave you there. And I'm, to say I'm disappointed is an understatement here. I'm looking for a little bit more focus at this point, a little bit more aggression. And just landing on the floor and bending down and picking it up isn't going to work with a rat in the wild. I'm just totally wrecking my show at this point. Okay, we're in Warwick Town now. We're gonna go for a little trip. Is that a smart car with no roof? I see he's found a Yankee Candles. That's it, we've never seen her again. <laughs> She's hooked on Yankee Candles. There's like no staff anywhere as well. This is a bit worrying. Got stopped by a woman. She literally stopped traffic and there was a lot of traffic to ask what I was recording and why and full on questioned everything. I'm home. It's 35 past seven now and I finally got in. Um, it's been a very, very long day and Asya has just gave me like everything. Like, look at this. There's two bags of Mars there and look at all them dairy snowmen. What the hell? Asya, you're a legend. I'm gonna be so fat, thank you. And like all these packets of crisps, I bought them and the nougats. And like, she bought a digestive caramel. Oh, Asya. Why are you trying to fatten me up? Are you going to eat me or something? She gave me a can of coat. Her family gave me sandwiches, like, whilst I was there. Amazing chicken sandwich. They're too nice. You people are too nice, all right? Um, but yeah, this is why I bought some nougats. Let me show you what's in here, because it's epic. This is a mini scale model, or whatever, of Warwick Castle. How cool is that? Out of everything they had, this is by far the best thing. Now, I really hope I got loads of really cool footage for you guys. Ahmed did do a load of footage with his camera again. Um, but it's just going to be a case of once he gets stuff edited and sent to me, I'll just use it as filler footage um, for other vlogs and stuff. But yeah, really hope you all enjoyed. If you did, leave a like and all that good stuff. But I'm going to edit this up now. Let's turn on my PC and then get this all edited and then go to sleep because I'm shattered. But thank you all for watching. I love your faces and bye bye. <laughs> Okay, now that's just taking the mick a bit, isn't it? Ha ha ha.